Hi, my name is Tom Frouse and I'm a Data School Consultant at the Information Lab. Within this session, I'm going to talk about how we can use a join to help us filter out data within Tableau Prep. For this example, I have some data related to sales and different targets. So this is my main data set here, which is my sales. So this is yearly sales for volume and value and we've got a row for each year. Now let's just say I also have a targets field uh, table as well. Notice this is in the same format. So we have year, our target volume and our target value. But this time we only have three years worth of data. So if I wanted to only keep the years worth of data where I have a target, uh, I can join this to my sales table using the join feature. We want to do an inner join on year, just as predicted here. Um, and then notice how it's only keeping three rows from my sales table, but then it's also excluding three. And that's keeping all of my targets table. So here the Tableau Prep has a nice visualization of what is being kept and what is being filtered. The ones in red, 2017, 2016, and 2015, have been filtered out because they are not in my targets field. If I create a clean step here, notice how we have joined the, the date, uh, data together, but we've only got the three rows as expected. So that's one way we can use a join to help us filter out some data. Another one is if we have a limits. So within this data set, I've got a minimum sales volume and then a maximum sales volume. So again, I'm going to use the same technique of joining to help limit the data from my sales table. So first I need to join the tables. So I drag my sales limits onto my sales to join. Now this time I'm not going to quite use uh, an equals. So if you click on the join condition, you can choose these. So I want my sales volume and then within the um, equal sign here, you can click. So then within Tableau Prep, there's a few different options, including not equals to, greater than or less than, and greater than or equals to. So for this one here, I want all of my, to keep all of my sales volumes, which are greater than or equal to my minimum sales volume. Great. Then I also want to limit my sales volume to, um, for the ones which are below my maximum. So to add a, another join clause, I can use the plus here, and then I'm going to choose sales volume, my equals sign. It's going to be less than or equal to my maximum sales volume. Now again, Tableau Prep has a really nice visual of what is being excluded and in included within the join. So as you can see, my numbers 100, 110, and 120, which are between my limits, are being included whereas 135, 90, and 65 are being filtered out. Now, for example, if I was to use the just the uh, less than um, symbol, notice how this updates and now 120 is being excluded. So just to show that within a clean step, only 2015 and 2018 are included. And that's just a couple of ways that you can use a join to help you filter out data within Tableau Prep. Thank you for watching. Make sure you subscribe to our channel and take a look at the next video within this series about how to scaffold your data.